In this video, we'll be learning about Windows Store. Windows Store is one place which allows you to download different types of games, applications, your music, your movies, or any entertainment item. So all these things you can download on this Windows platform. Like if you have heard about Google Play, that is used for downloading all the Google apps which can work on your Google platform. Let's say, if you want to download on your Windows 10 platform, you have this option as Windows Store. So if you click on this Windows Store, it will give you a dialog box, the entire window, which says, do you want to go to home? Do you want to download all the apps? You want the games? You want the music, movies or TV? So different options it will give. Let us start with this apps. So if I say different apps, different, different applications, if you download any one application, it can work on different platforms your tablet, your smartphone, your laptops, desktops, everywhere. So if you see, if you scroll down, you can find out different types of apps which are given as top free apps according to rating. Also, you can see top paid apps which are also paid apps available here. So you can find out the ratings, you can find out the price and you can download as per your requirement. Also, similarly, you find there are some games available same method so you have this top paid games and you have top free games which are given so you can just click on this place and you can download there are music movies and tv let us see how do we download any one of them so i'll just go to this apps i'll show you one method the same method would be applicable everywhere and now i'll scroll down at this moment i'll want to download this facebook so what i'll do is i'll just click on this facebook i'm in the apps i'll click on this facebook so if you want, you can download some other part also. Instead of Facebook, you can go for Instagram or some other method, some other application. It says it is free and it is get. So I can just click on this get part. But before that, if you see there are screenshots for PC, these are the different screenshots for the Facebook. Some details about the Facebook would be given. It can be available on your PC and your mobile and so on. Few things are given here. So simply what you have to do is, if you want to download, just click on this get part and it, it will be downloaded, it will take some time, okay, it has started downloading. Now, suppose if you are using your account on this laptop, okay, your email ID, Hotmail account on your account here itself, and same account if you are using on your mobile or tablet, and if you have downloaded here, it will be applicable for all the platforms, different platforms. Now, after the getting downloaded, downloading, it will get installed automatically, you can see here, so it says it is downloading 110.7 MB. So if you want, you can pause. If you want, you can keep a cross on this place. So it will not get downloaded. So once it is downloaded, what will happen is it will install. If you see the notification, just got installed, check it out. This is a notification. If you remember, you'll get all the notifications in the notification bar. Let us see that. Now, if you see the icon color has changed, it is in the white color. So if I click on this place, and if you see the action center is giving a notification it says facebook just got installed check it out now if you want to check it out just click on this place and the facebook will open yeah so if you have your username and password you can just enter username password and you can click on login and that would be the facebook app which you have downloaded and you can use it in a proper manner i can just click on this close part so same way if you see you can also download the games same method no difference you can just select the top free games let's say if you click on this place you have to just click on this get and it will be downloaded automatically it will be installed you do not have to install by your own you don't have to work any hard or else sometimes you do not know whether it's a game or an app or something that time this search box will be important it will be useful so you just type the name, suppose you know the name of the game as Mario and you don't know what exactly it is, is it an application, it's a game. So you can see all things related to Mario will come. The first one is a game, second one is an album, third one is a game and the last one is a song and that's a game. So whichever you think is your Mario application or a game, you can just click on that place. Let's say if you click on this place. The same thing will get and you can just click on this place and you can download. Now this belongs to a game part and it is in this section itself, right? And you can just, once your work is done, you can just click on this close part. 
right? So I hope you are able to understand what exactly is Windows Store, how to use it and how the things get installed. That's all for this video.